hi guys today we are going to see the how to select circuit breaker based on load so that concept today we are going to see so see here this is one of the MCCB so the bottom side has been mentioned for the MCCB tripping current rating so this is a 32 ampere tripping current MCB so this is a single pole and then short circuit breaking capacity also mentioned in downside see here 10,000 ampere and then on off indication also available and then the make the what kind of make Snyder ABB what the brand make brand name I mean also mentioned in top so here are the MCCB MCB ratings are mentioned here so see here the voltage rating and then UI the insulation voltage rating and the impulse voltage rating so all the things has been mentioned so see here this is the input and output uh, knobs that means the screws so the bottom side has been the placing lock also available in here so this is a simple demo of MCB that means the circuit breaker the MCB explanation in the miniature circuit breaker so now we are going to see the uh, how to select MCB that means the miniature circuit breaker uh, based on load so this is a not a simple and single word the based on load we are going to select the, uh, select the circuit breaker so this is not easy for selecting circuit breaker so we need to consider some terms so these are the all the terms based to we select the MCB miniature circuit breaker so we need to see the what are the terms we need to consider and how to we choose the MCB based on the load so then we choose the formula that means the single phase or three phase based on load to we select the MCB so first one is tripping current so what is mean by tripping current so that means the more than that current going going to pass the MCB the MCB going to trip the circuit and isolate the circuit and then isolate the faulty section and the healthy section so this is the thing we mentioned for the tripping current the so how much tripping current we choose on here so that is more than load current that means if you have a load current for uh, 8 ampere you need to select for 10 ampere tripping current MCB so after that I will tell you how to select the tripping current so mostly we select for the 80 percentage of uh, load current has been we select for the 100 percentage that means you have a 80 percentage then you need to select for 100 percentage of tripping current and then ke rating so how to we select for the ke rating what is mean by ke rating actually ke rating means the short circuit breaking capacity so that means the one second the flexible that means the rising surge current the mccb not going to trip so this is the thing we are going to mention so this is the thing has been mentioned for the ke rating so after that the voltage and frequency and number of volts has been based on the phase you, you are using for the single phase maybe the, the 230 voltage and 3 phase and 440 voltage and 420 voltage any of that the frequency has been as usual 50 hertz 40 hertz or 60 hertz any of that the number of poles has been based on phases you are used choosing for single phase or three phase whatever you choose so this is the thing we need to select here and then temperature so what kind of temperature you need to maintain the cold area or the hot areas those are the thing we need to select the temperatures this all the things have been the basics and then we need to select for the application so the application has been very important what kind of application you are using for light fan or uh, air conditioner so what kind of load you are using to select the MCB so that is the very important thing here so this is the seven terms to we select the MCB rating so miniature circuit breaker we need to consider the seven terms to select and then after that we are going to select for the based on the uh, formula that means the single phase has been P is equal to V into I cost by and 3 phase P is equal to root 3 VI cost by the P has been power and then V has been voltage I is the current cost by is a power factor so this is a simple formula so I after that I going to explain how to choose the based on the one by one so first thing uh, the tripping current based so see here the market has been available the for the MCB rating so see here 2 ampere to 63 ampere for single pole and 3 pole and then tripping current 
has also mentioned for the in this side how to we choose this table for correct so now i show you how to this table has been correct so take the assume a 2.5 kilowatt load we have now and then pow power has been v p is equal to v cos pi the single phase so here assume cos pi that means the power factor has been 0.8 this is for assumption power factor so see here the power we know the 2.5 kilowatt and then the voltage has been uh, 230 voltage for ac and then current we don't know so power cos pi has been 0.8 so here we got for the ampere rating for uh, for 2500 kilowatt that mean the watts and then 230 to the by 0.8 this is a simple mathematic so see here so the finally we got a current rating for 12 sorry 13 point something has been 13.5 ampere so here this is a 80 percentage so we need to select for 100 percentage so 100 percentage 13.5 means we need to select for 16 ampere breaker so why it is we need to select because of the 16 ampere breaker has been performing the good performance for the 80 Eighty percentage of the the tripping current. That means you are selecting for two ampere for tripping current has been one point six, and then four ampere and three point two, and then six ampere for four point eight. That means the your load current has been four point eight. You need to select for six. Your load current has been eight. You need to select for ten ampere breaker. So now we have a load current for thirteen point five ampere. So we going to select for sixteen ampere breaker on here. So this is a for single. so here we choose for the uh, single pole so sp so suppose we use for the three phase on here the same calculation so we in take cos pi the root 3 is in front of and then now the 2.5 kilowatt and then root 3 here 440 voltage for the voltage because of the three phase and the current we don't know the cos pi at is a 0.8 so here the current has been probably we got for the 4 point something of here so so here we got for the current for 4 point something hertz so here we are going to select for the 4 point means the 10 ampere because of the tp tp is are not available 6 and 4 and 2 ampere so the mostly the small ranges has been the 10 ampere and what's on the tp is available tp means triple pole so we select for the tp on here so this is a way of we are selecting for the tripping current based mcb and then the poles has been mentioned for the three phase or single phase based on the pole has been choose down here after that we choose the frequency the frequency as is well the based on your location where is it is that mean that you are in the uae that mean the dubai you have 50 hertz suppose you a you in usa you car for 60 hertz so what are the place so the place based on your thing has been that mean the frequency has been decided here so frequency is not a matter on here so the three terms has been completed here the frequency the voltage voltage has been completed and frequency also completed on here and tripping current based also completed for the single table so this two has been already done so this is a mostly default the voltage and frequency has been default so this is not very variable because of we choose for the based on the place and based on the applications so if we if is we use for 230 voltage you can choose for the one 10 voltage also because of the mccb mcb mostly designed for the uh, two ratings that mean the two flexible ratings so 50 hertz 60 hertz are based on the places of uh, you are choosing the mcb that mean the applications and then temperature temperature has been the same thing suppose you are choosing in the saudi and then uae otherwise qatar so what kind of the place based on place you can choose for the temperature so there's a thing the 55 hertz or the cold area and then hot area so are based on you can select for the temperature so this is almost we complete for the selection of mcb that mean the 
tripping current voltage frequency poles the almost be finished on here so now the final one is the k rating the what is mean by k rating the k rating means kilo ampere so kilo ampere mean the short circuit tripping current so mostly they are saying short circuit tripping current so short circuit tripping current means what is it so mostly the short circuit tripping current rating has been available for 3.5 ke and 6 ke and 10 ke that that means a 3500 ampere and then 6000 ampere and then 10000 ampere so how do we predict this ampere rating based on the load so here we are not based on predict this for the load we are predict the total circuits current that means that for you are choosing the 1500 kva circuit so we choose for the four percentage of the closed circuit current so this has been the not tripping the mcb for the one second that means the less than one second has been considered to less than one um, one second that means you are current has been passed through less than one second the mccb is not going to trip because of the load fluctuations has been occurred for the milli milli milliseconds so that time the mcb going to break the circuit and isolate the circuit so that's why this is a thing very important so total load of the circuit that means the load current of the circuit for the 50 kva means you can select for the four percentage of the circuit and then mostly we choose for the four percentage of the circuit current that means the full circuit current so this is the thing we are going to easily select for the ka rating the ka rating has been a very important things we need to select for the uh, mcb so most of the applications base based mcb has been selected in nowadays that means the what kind of application you are choosing that means so, so now we are going to use for the light load that means the tube lights and then whatever lights you have and that though you use for light load means you can select for the 10 ampere mcb this is the most suitable and then 90 percentage of suitable this one and then if you can use for fans that means the small fans you can use for 10 ampere same and then sockets uh, you can fix for 16 ampere is uh, more than enough otherwise you can choose for 20 ampere mcb suppose you can use for ac air conditioner you can use choose must for 32 ampere to and 25 ampere so some cases you can choose for 20 ampere also so the pump loads you must choose for the 32 and then otherwise the 40 ampere sorry 20 ampere so 32 and 20 ampere you can choose for the probably of the pumps that mean the pumps of the motor so whatever you have to select for based on applications so motor has been you choose for 40 ampere so this is the for the ideal thing that means you want for the based on application based things so you need to select for this kind of uh, mcb rating for directly so without uh, referring any of tables so don't forget to subscribe and share if you have any doubt please comment here thank you for watching